Today we're going to make some French press coffee. It looks very intimidating, but it's not. This is the best cup of coffee you can have. All right? It's very easy to make. Okay? So I already set up my coffee bar, as you can see. I have all the Portuguese liquors. I have 1920. I have uh, Anish, Beirão, Maceira. I have the uh, Cheirinho Aguardente. I have my vine. I have uh, our Vint Velho, Constantino. There's many other varieties. So, you know, choose whatever one you want, okay? So, of course, I have my Maria cookies, too. There's a little dessert. My husband wants 1920 today, so I already poured a shot of uh, 1920. All right, um, so let's go. Okay, all you need to do is, for this uh, press, is 32 ounces, so I put one tablespoon per cup of coffee, which is about eight ounces. But if you like a strong cup of coffee, just uh, put two tablespoons per cup. Okay, so this water is boiling. We're going to fill it right up to the top with this boiling water. All right, there it goes. All right, perfect. Okay, so now I'm going to put that plunger right over it. Okay, and we're going to wait five minutes. Okay, five minutes is the time it needs to brew. This makes a really hot cup of coffee. When you go to coffee bars, their coffee is really hot and strong because they brew it at 200 degrees. Now you'll never get a hot cup of coffee like in a coffee bar because you see um, like our care eggs or basic coffee makers, they'll never uh, get the temperature that high. That's why most people love the French press. Okay, so we'll be back in five minutes. Okay, everybody, it's been five minutes. Uh, the coffee has brewed. So we're gonna do, we're gonna press down on the plunger Okay, we're gonna go very slow. Okay. Perfect, okay. So now you can just pour your cup of coffee. Now, with this coffee, you may find that there's some grounds and sediment that develop in the bottom. So you may not wanna pour that last uh, ounce or two. Okay, so let's pour. Okay, there it goes. Oh wow, that smells delicious. Okay, so now it's up to you. Um, you can add some sugar. So my husband likes it pretty strong. So I'm gonna give him a couple of teaspoons of sugar. Now normally, um, if you wanna put a, a Cheirinho in your coffee, you, you would have your coffee black, okay? But if you want your shot of liquor on the side, you can also have black or you can add cream. So it's pretty much up to you. But I'm gonna add a little cream today. Give it, make it a little lighter. Okay. All right, let's, 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 um, looks great. Isn't that beautiful? 